Hello guys, how are you doing? So, welcome back to my reactions and as you can see I'm going to watch episode 110 of One Piece today. So this last episode was really good, I was really happy to see that everyone managed to get out of that place safely, thanks to the help of Sanji and Vivi, and it was also really surprising to see that Mr. Tree was still alive uh, inside of one of those alligators thanks to like this wax wax power, uh, he managed to create this uh, like shelter for himself. Uh, so yeah, in the end it was really helpful because uh, he really had to create this key to open that cell uh, because even that key uh, that was uh, eaten by one of those alligators uh, wasn't uh, going to work because uh, Crocodile had the real one. Uh, so yeah, that was really sad to see, but in the end we already know that Crocodile uh, is really not making anything easy for these guys. But thankfully they managed to do it, they found a way, and even though Mr. Tree didn't want to help at the start, uh, he got beaten by Sanji in the end and got forced to create that key. Uh, so yeah, it was nice to see that uh, everyone escaped, and also that Luffy really wanted Zoro to go and save um, Captain Smoker, because he couldn't get out of there uh, by himself, since uh, he can't swim because of that Devil Fruit power. Uh, so yeah, it was nice to see that um, he had this attitude, but then again, it's normal from Luffy, he's just uh, really kind and he's not going to allow someone to die like that, uh, in, and it doesn't matter if uh, Captain Smoker was uh, going after him. Uh, so yeah, it was nice to see that Captain Smoker uh, repaid that kindness and let those guys uh, proceed to, um, to Alubarna. And now I'm really curious to see if they're actually going to reach uh, that place in this episode or not. Uh, but I'm really like uh, excited to see what's going to happen. I really hope that they manage to stop Crocodile. Uh, but yeah, it's not going to be easy and I don't know when they will be fighting uh, like eventually. Uh, but yeah, we'll see. Either way, really uh, excited to start this episode. So hope you guys are ready and let's start it. And I forgot to mention, but Chopper also helped a lot by tricking Crocodile into believing that he was Mr. Prince. Hopefully later. Damn. Well, even without the title, that was pretty obvious. Also curious to see if Captain Smoker is going to Alubarda as well. Damn. Oh. So he's doing it like this. Yeah, it's not because of those. Damn. Probably a lot of people joining soon. Oh. Um. Yeah, exactly. That's what the perfume was for. That mount, though. Well, he's with Chopper. Yeah, he's coming. What the? <laughs> Where did he find that? A moving crab.
I'm really curious to see where he found this guy. <laughs> Look at that smile. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Looks like Luffy. Oh, Lash's friend, really. That explains it a bit. Oh. Yeah, we already noticed a bit of that. <laughs> That's... That face. It's really like a pervy face. Oh, this guy. Damn. Nice. Yeah, we knew that they were coming. He's going to stay there. That's too dangerous for him alone. At least someone else needs to stay as well. Or maybe everyone. Yeah, Zoro is going to say. In the end, they really can't waste time, so... Oh, he's not saying. So they're believing in Luffy. I hope so, but... Yeah, I understand that they can't waste time. And Luffy is going to buy them sometime. Yeah. <laughs> this was up. That's nice. We know that Luffy is strong, don't take me wrong, but... If it's Crocodile and Missile Sunday, that's going to be really hard. By himself. Yeah, both of them are here. There's still a, a lot of people they need to stop. I'm really curious to see these two guys fighting.
Hmm. <laughs> He's gay. Yep. Hmm. Wait, Nico Robin. Hmm. So that's a real name. Not um Miss All Sunday. That's just a code name. Well, let's see what happens in these three minutes. At least he's going to fight one on one. He needs to be really careful because of this power, since he can, like, uh, dehydrate you. And that's really dangerous in this place. Not just in this place, like, if you don't get water, you're done. If I think this is going to be really tricky. You can just vanish like that. I wonder how we can actually eat him. Doesn't work as well. Oh. The first one seemed to do something. <laughs> Sand Gator. And this power is so... I wonder if he's like um if water is a counter to him. Like the sun gets all wet and can't like vanish, I don't know. But there isn't even water around, so Yeah, that's the thing. You need to dodge that. Damn. He 
Got that hole. <laughs> the desert's been split. <laughs> I love Luffy's reactions. Girasole? That's like the flower? No, that's sunflower, not... But it's like that in my language, so... Damn... That's dangerous. Yep. He needs to grab something. Yeah, we saw one before. Hmm. Yeah. Probably not the best place to fight this guy. Nice. Oh, finger net. Oh, my God. Damn, it cut him. Holy. That's so bad. Yeah, that's what he did before. Oh my God. He needs to be really careful. Yeah, water could probably revert that, but... Oh! Oh yeah, that there! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> that was really funny! Yep. He's using that guy's power. Munch munch. <laughs> Eating sand. That's gonna taste really bad though. Oh, it's that move from before, right? When he defeated all of those pirates, that's really dangerous. He needs to get out of there. I'm actually not sure what um, Nico Robin uh, was going to do since she left. I don't know if she went after these guys. Hmm. Hello, Barna. 
Wait. Yeah, you, but not Alubarna. Alubarna is to the side, not south. It's really bad for the guy there. This is such a one-sided battle right now. What? Wait. What happened? Did you like stab him or something? Oh my god. I can't believe that actually happened. Oh my god, this episode. That was... Man, this cliffhanger is too much. I really need to, to watch the next episode as soon as possible because this is like this episode was so intense in a way, but so one-sided because we could see that Luffy can't really do much about uh, like this crocodile's power. And right now I can't like f like figure a way to defeat this guy unless uh, like it involves that uh, idea of um, making his sand wet so he could actually like eat it. Uh, but yeah, like right now I'm really lost because I'm not too sure uh, like what's going to happen to Luffy. He just got pierced uh, by that um, like a uh, weapon that Crocodile has. I don't know the exact name of that uh, of that thing. Uh, but yeah, that's like really something really bad, and I really want to watch uh, what's going to happen. And yeah, like I'm really curious about a lot of things right now. Uh, mostly about the way to defeat uh, Crocodile. As he said, like in the desert, it's going to be uh, really hard to beat this guy because it's full of sand, so it's going to be his uh, ideal place to fight. And I'm also surprised uh, to see that um, he revealed uh, Miss Alcindor's name. Apparently, she's Nick Robin. And I recognize his name. I might have heard his name somewhere because... Like, um, One Piece is pretty popular, so of course I'm going to recognize some of the more popular names. But I'm not too sure of, uh, like, who Nick Robin even is. Uh, apparently, she's Miss All Sunday. Uh, but yeah, I'm not too sure of uh, what she was about to do. She eventually left, and I'm, like, I don't know if she's actually going after, uh, like, Vivi and the others. I don't know if that was said or not. Uh, but yeah, uh, it was a good thing that Luffy was fighting Crocodile one on one at least. But at the same time, we saw that um, it was like uh, really all of the attacks that Luffy did uh, were useless because he just couldn't eat um, uh, Crocodile in the end. And uh, now this really bad thing happened. I was already like really surprised when uh, his arm became like that, but we knew that it's one of Crocodile's power. And yeah. Thankfully, he still had that water around and he managed to get a drink and revert that situation on his arm. But right now, it's way more serious because it just got uh, uh, like pierced in the chest, I believe. I'm not too sure where it was. Uh, hopefully, it wasn't in a, like a, some vital spot. Uh, but yeah, I'm really uh, curious to watch this next episode. Really want to see uh, how this fight is going to end. I'm not too sure if he's uh, going to be able to... like. Um, uh, get out of this uh, situation like right now I'm not even sure uh, how Luffy is we know that he got pierced but yeah I don't want to believe that he's going to die here uh, like it would be uh, a really like um, big event and I'm not believing that it's going to happen right now uh, so yeah either way really can't wait to watch this next episode so I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this one and if you did please like and subscribe to the channel and you can also join my Discord and my Patreon if you want to get early access to my full reactions. So yeah, I'll see you all in the next one, so take care guys!